As you guys know, we've been working a long time on our basement, a long time. And I'm not exaggerating when I say it's been a year. We are gonna go to Target to go see if we can find some cute decor for the basement. We are going to give you guys what you've been wanting and asking for forever. <laughs> We're gonna give you the basement tour. Thanks to Samsung for sponsoring today's video. Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm so excited. It's here, it's here, it's here. Okay, Corey, it's here. You guys, what is that? You guys, we ordered the Samsung, the Premier 4K triple laser projector for our basement. Oh my gosh, it's here. It's here. What is that? It's our here? Samsung. Yes. <gasps> yes, I'm so excited to watch our the performance. I know, I'm seriously so excited. Red Whatever, dude, I'm watching football first. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Okay, bring it in. I want to show everybody if I'm about the one this. Installing it, I'm watching. First. <laughs> Look at Bailey. Bailey's like, oh my gosh, what is that? What is it? What is it, babe? Oh my gosh! Look at that beaut. Look at that beaut, Corey. This is shall we? Okay, I cannot wait. Yeah, like? yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> wow. Do you guys know what this is for? Do you guys even understand what this is for? Okay, I'm so excited. As you guys know, we've been working a long time on our basement, a long time. And I'm not exaggerating when I say it's been a year. Huh, Corey? It's been a yeah. long year. Because, you know, supplies with everything going on, it took a long time for us to get our basement. But we are so close. In fact, in a minute, I'm gonna take you guys downstairs and show you what we're thinking for the final touches. But this right here, this projector is going to be the one greatest asset to our basement. Why? Because this is what it's all about, entertainment. And my kids are so excited to have like friends come over. I think, you guys know me on my Sundays. I love to have movie night Sunday night. It's like my favorite thing. If you guys watch us, you know, you've heard me say that. So I'm so excited to be able to bring this downstairs and have a movie night with my family. One thing I really love about this whole projector Look, there's no wires, which well, makes just, it really clean. Yeah, and the way that it sets up is mm -hmm. you actually put it up right against the wall. It's not hanging from the ceiling, it's not anywhere else. And you can see it, the camera comes right out here and it goes right on, just goes right up here on the wall. Yeah, and which it's makes it nice. 130 inches. 130 inches, you That's guys, huge. which is really big. And one thing I like about it too is that, like, you know, those projectors that hang from the ceiling, and so if someone gets up in the middle of a movie, they're walking. And then it, like, yeah, it gets like the shadow. The screen, yeah. We don't have to worry about that with this one. And I think I'm so excited about it. Let me install it and we can check it out. Yeah, we'll have to get it installed. But we're, so we I need to show, get everything, get everything all set up. yeah, I need to show them what we're thinking for the basement. In fact, you guys, I'll just take you guys downstairs and show what we're thinking right now. I want to show you guys the basement, what we're thinking of doing down here. So as you can see, I've got the screen there. I wanna find like a console table. I may even take the screen down. I'm not 100% sure that we'll, we will keep it up. And then I'm gonna get a tree in the corner over here. I wanna get, maybe move the whole rug back and move the couch back so we can make more space, more seating, and maybe do like a fun chair over here. I already have the pillows. I bought these um, a while ago. So I love the pillows in here. I think it looks good. And then over here on this wall, I am thinking I wanna do like a gallery wall. So I wanna go find different sizes of picture frames and put it right here and over here so we got our subway tile put on which I absolutely love and then we got our casing around the window which still needs to be painted so by the end of the video you guys will see all that completed we have our floating shelves which I want to decorate so I'm going to take you guys to the store with us to see what we can find to put on these and then something maybe to go along the countertops so I got Kesley here we are gonna go to Target to go see if we can find some cute decor for the basement it's gonna be so cute. I'm gonna go look around, see what they have there. And if we have time, maybe we'll swing by another store too, maybe Ikea or something, I don't know. But I wanna find some cute decor to put downstairs, maybe like a cute little tree to put in the corner. I don't know, we're just gonna go out and look. Let's go. Kesley okay, spotted these pillows and she wants to make her room all kind of polish. I don't think that pillow's cute. With already the black and cream pillows, that would be cute in there. Mm -hmm. This sitting on one of my floating shelves. I love these cute little cutting 
boards. I think those are really cute to style. I love the idea of having like a little cake stand sitting on the shelf, except I kind of want one that has color so it's not just wood on wood. Love this. This would be a great place to put like a little plant and then like your remotes or something in here. And I was wanting to find something, maybe like a little table to put in front of my couch or you know i don't know i just think that's kind of cute okay i came to look for a console under the table but this is actually too short it needs to be a little bit longer but i actually and i kind of want to have it maybe darker to match like my wall okay i also want like i said extra seating these could be really cute to put just off the side so when people come and sit they can kind of grab them just kind of it's more seating just come hang it or even just use it as footrest they have so many cute fall things here oh my gosh guys, I want to give you an update on the basement. We were trying to find a console table to go right here. We couldn't find one. And I ran into a friend who said he could build us something really cool. So he started it last week. He's coming over to put up a little bit of it today. And I just can't wait for you guys to see the entire project. You guys, this is going to be so fun. We have such a cute basement coming along and I can't wait to show you. All right, you guys, it is a new day. Kids are at school. Corey and I are heading out now to go get some decorations to decorate the basement. And I just can't wait to like, see what we can find for that basement. We have some exciting final reveals. Mm -hmm. Anyway, okay, so we're gonna head out to the store. You guys are gonna come with us, let's go. I need to find some baskets to go on the bottom of my built-ins that I got done. So he, there's like a bottom shelf on my built-ins and I need to have like five baskets. Okay, I need a runner to go in front of my kitchen sink. There's some cute rugs in here. Still on a hunt for a nice bowl to put some popcorn in when their friends come over and things. So I think that is like a really cute bowl. While we're out and about, we always stop and look at the dog stuff. Like I'm looking at this cute little dog treat. It says feed me and thirsty. I just told Corey, I'm like, we need to get the new ones. <laughs> They're so cute. And look, my stuff. And then I just love like all the puppy things. Like I told Corey how perfect this would be for Bailey. Like look, it's tall. And then Lucy can have the other one because she's littler. I mean, so cute. Should we get the princess, both of them, their own little special dog bed down the basement? Yeah, Using the little tiny <laughs> Bailey That's sits crazy. on Lucy's and she thinks she is Lucy's size, I swear. My mom got one for Lucy, but I think we should get one for Bailey. Bailey would love this. Hey guys, Corey and I are back from the store. I am going to run downstairs. We have bags and bags full of so many good things. I was able to get tons of good stuff. I got some good ideas. I can't wait for you guys to see. I also had the girl who's helping with my basement bring a bag of stuff too. We're gonna go put this together. And I cannot wait for you guys to see it. It's gonna be so good. Okay, let's go. to have a dedicated shelf to Logan. I need to get a photo in here still of Logan, but I found this frame and I absolutely love it. I brought this from upstairs, downstairs. So this is supposed to be what it looked like the night he passed away. And in fact, my Betsy Mike Sell gave this to me years ago and it's my favorite thing ever. So this is one shelf I kind of want to dedicate to Logan. I wanted a plant that looked real. And so we made it ourselves. Isn't that kind of cool? So it looks totally real, but without the maintenance of it. Guys, I have Kesley here and she and I are, well, I'm on the stairs, she's in the basement area. We are going to give you guys 
what you've been wanting and asking for forever. Totally. <laughs> We're gonna give you the basement tour. Kesley's gonna be doing a full tour of her bedroom on her channel. She still has a few things that's gonna in the works there that she's working on yeah. and a bathroom too. Exactly. So we are just gonna show you guys the theater room and the kitchenette. And been waiting for yeah, us to be ready for, for a long, long time. And now it's fully decorated. It looks amazing. And we're gonna take you guys on a tour and we can't wait for you guys to see it. So come on. Dun, da, 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 da. Okay, we'll start over here first. Okay, this is our newly designed wall here. So I love the built-ins that we had made. And oh, they're, so cute. they're so cute. And so we had a screen up here on the wall that we actually took down because we were able to use our new projector and it is 130 inches. So it's as big as that, which is so awesome, you guys. Kesley's had her friends over. They've watched movies down here already. It is so fun. We'll show you guys later because we're gonna have a movie night later and show you guys how awesome it is and how cool it looks with a movie on. But it's just kind of nice. Anyway, so over here, like I said, we got a new tree and here's all the fun decorations. So this is something really kind of cool. I don't know if you guys see these. All these are all like old books <laughs> and we tore like some of the backs of the books off of them and we stuck them just in this little like bowl. And so yeah, we got all sorts of different type of decor decorations, which is so fun. And, and then put yeah, we got some baskets. And yeah, this will be like where we'll put all the video games and things in that my kids play. So there's all that right here on this side. And then we found this really old rocking chair it's so at an antique store as well. And I thought it would just kind of, it was like a fun little piece. Mm -hmm. I was gonna do something a little bit different and then I'm like, no, I like this. It's no, just it different and I love it. So over here we have our couch and we've had this for a while, but I love the way we decided to set it up to make it a little bit longer. So we took the ottoman and made it so the couch a little bit longer this way. And then we got this little table, which is such a fun little piece in here. It just adds so much. And as you guys know, I've always had these pillows. I've got these pillows about a month ago. And so over here on this wall, we were waiting to do like a little cabinet with some, but everything, like I said, it's hard to come by anymore. Like I couldn't even get a console table over here. So I was waiting for this cabinet. Anyway, it's on back order. And so until like next year, <laughs> and I still have my picture I'm gonna hang right here. Another favorite part of this entire room is the gaming area. So this was very important to me as a mom and Corey to have our kids wanna be down here, hanging out with their friends, playing games, not just watching movies. I mean, it's fun to do that too, but it's like a lot of fun to like hang out and play games. And these are the type of games I grew up doing. We got air hockey over here. And what is really cool about this guy right here, you guys, is it's not just a ping pong table. It's also a pool table. Check it out, guys. What do you think? We love having all this. So we've got four games down here, four different types of games that kids can play. And believe it or not, this is one of their favorite spaces to hang out. Mm -hmm. Now, over here is our kitchenette. And I love, this. I love just like all the little details over here. Okay, I was so excited when we found these. Yeah. Okay, how cute are those? And guess the best part is, guys, they have to put real quarters in there. I mean, I will, you know, so the, I, my kids aren't just down here chugging candy, which is like, I don't know. I just know my kids would be down here chugging candy, so I'll give them quarter. We and you can take it off, like obviously, and they'll just take quarters out. But it's kind of cool that we can. I'm not gonna charge Kesley's friends or anything to come yeah, get wait, drinks. Aren't you? Aren't you gonna get like a, a little bowl of just quarters? Yeah, I probably. Yeah, I'll just put like a like something here, like some quarters that kids can use, and then just more of these, just more, more plants. More plants. <laughs> plants. I love plants. And then we got our microwave down here and our ice maker machine, which Ooh. has been the biggest like thing ever. We've yeah, loved you guys, it. You guys have been using it a ton. We have, we've used it a lot. And then we've got our um, <laughs> farmhouse sink and then our mini fridge. We don't keep drinks down here very often because my kids will just drink, uh, drink, <laughs> drink, drink. So I like to get it on the weekends so the kids can have is you know with friends over and have a lot of soda and things like that. That's just my way of being like, hey, let's make it kind of fun, like an occasional thing. That is it guys. This is the entire basement tour right here. Like I said, Kessie will show you guys later what she is planning on doing with her bedroom mm -hmm. and her bathroom in here. And then, as you guys know, this is supposed to be my gym and it's a disaster. It's more like storage. We still haven't even, look. I mean, I'm ashamed to even show you this, 
But plus we have a lot of Kesley's clothing and stuff in here too. Coming soon. There's a sneak peek for you guys. There's so many things. Mm -hmm. um, so we're going to make this into a gym and then we're going to try to get like a storage or like a little warehouse for Kesley's clothing and stuff. So, yep. There you guys go. Okay, now that you guys have seen the basement in its glory. Hallelujah. It's been a long time coming, but I'm so grateful and so excited. Um, Kesley and I are going to head out and go get a drink. She's actually going to go film a video for her channel right now. And then I think we're going to come back. I'm going to make some really good dinner. She's begging me to make my chicken enchilada soup, but I'm kind of wanting to make taco soup tonight. I don't know. I'm going to make one. I just make a good soup tonight. And then I think we're going to come down here tonight and watch a movie as a family. Just hang out. I'm going to show you how amazing this little setup is. Because right now it just looks like a blank wall. But wait, there's more. So for tonight's dinner on the menu, I'm just going to cook it in the crock pot. Normally I wouldn't do that, but because I need to use my meat, I'm going to do it in the crock pot today. I'm doing taco soup. I did one pound of ground turkey. You can do ground beef if you prefer, but I'm doing ground turkey. I did one can of black beans drained, one can of corn drained, and I did two teaspoons of garlic, minced garlic, which is at the bottom, and then one yellow onion so far. Now I'm going to add in some petite diced tomatoes. I just wanna dump it in there. Now I'm gonna add in some diced green chilies. Then I'm gonna do low sodium chicken broth. I'm doing two cups. Yeah. One tablespoon chili powder. One tablespoon of ground cumin. Half teaspoon of salt. Half a teaspoon of garlic salt. Half a teaspoon of pepper. Half a teaspoon of paprika. One fourth garlic powder. One fourth of your onion powder. One fourth crushed red pepper. And then last, we are doing one fourth dried oregano. And then you just let it, I guess, since I'm doing it in the crock pot, James, and let it simmer on low for about six to eight hours. We just clean up dinner. And look, I put up fall decor. <laughs> this is stuff I had last year. We are gonna go downstairs and watch a movie, pop some popcorn, and hang out. One of my favorite things to do. We're downstairs, we wanna show you how cool the Samsung projector is. So we pulled up the Leroy's channel on YouTube. Perry was watching her makeup tutorial. I wanna show you guys how cool this is. So if you look here, this is where it plays up here. So it's kinda of nice, you don't have to worry about anyone walking in front and, and making a shadow on it. But we got our thing, look how big it is, 130 inches. I don't know even know if this even does it justice. Let me stand back. Aww, she's so little. Another really cool thing about the Samsung projector is look at all of the apps that you have access to right here. And you can stream music. Rhett can play his video games as well. Reese likes to watch YouTube. Reese likes to watch YouTube. And I love to FaceTime Brock because it's so big and it just is so fun. Yeah, it's a really Should cool we feature. FaceTime him? Are you serious? <laughs> yeah, I want to see. I want to show you. I want to show them. Okay, we'll show you guys how this works when you FaceTime. Okay, she's got Brock on there. Look. On FaceTime. <laughs> oh, what the heck? <laughs> He's life-size, Kes. He's actually bigger than life-size. Yeah, you're bigger than life-size. <laughs> you're 130 inches. You're 130 inches. Come hug me. Hugs. I hugged you. Another really cool thing about the projector is that it's super easy to install and it's portable. So my kids can take this outside during the summertime. I mean, we can take this with us anywhere, which is so great. And we are going to watch our movie. So we're gonna end our video. Make sure you guys check out Samsung's channel. I will have all the information linked down below. Thank you so much for watching and hope you guys like our new basement tour. Comment down below and let me know what you guys think. And we will see you guys next time.